And with this video, we're going to take a look at how you can uh, quickly solve the problem with the thermal shutdown occur or the uh, HP laptop uh, fan not working correctly. So the fan is not working and causing overheating uh, of the laptop, as you can see right here. And it can cause other uh, problems on your computer as well. So I'm just going to uh, tap on the continue button. I'm just going to tap on the press on the enter button. So you can see here um, when your laptop gets overheated, it will automatically um, uh, shut down itself. And you will see it say the laptop is overheating. Uh, the tap, laptop will start to go lagging really slow. Uh, this part here gets uh, really hot and warm, uh, especially where the CPU is around here, where the fan is supposed to uh, uh, blow out the cool air. So you can see here on the side there is a um, an air compartment right there. That's the fan and the back here. That's where the air is supposed to come out. Right here. So it's quite hot at the moment. So that's uh, the fan exhaust uh, escape where the hot air come out. Uh, this is the air uh, coming in. It's not blowing any hot air out because the the fan is not uh, working correctly. So what you can do is um, you can try to um, using a um, some dust blower uh, to blow out. I uh, have the dust cover here, so blow out any dust uh, on the vent right here and the vent below here as well. Blow out any dust that's covering the fan. Sometimes the fan itself is not working. The fan is uh, faulty. Uh, when the fan is uh, faulty, you can use this um, external fan. So I've got this external fan here. So this external fan I bought online for $10 or $15, depending on where you get them. They're fairly cheap. You, you may uh, get lucky, you can get it a few dollars. So this has been used quite a lot. You can see quite a lot of dust here. Um, I have successfully used this with this laptop and that solved the overheating issues. So here you put this um, fan. On this fan here it also has the controller. So you can control the fan speed. So this knob, so you use this knob here and control it. And you, you put this uh, rubber gasket around the, the vent right there and you put it against the back. Of the laptop, like so. Yeah. And then you put it in from that side. Okay. And then we're using the USB plug, we just plug into one of this whole available USB port. Let's uh, do one over here. This and that one on this side. So I'm just going to plug it in. So let's just plug it in. Uh, once the laptop provides power. So you need the laptop to cool down first. Once it's cooled down, uh, it will... Uh, uh, once it's cooled down, it will start up normally to allow time for it to uh, cool down. So you can see... Um, the fan will blow the air out at the back here. So what it does is suck the air in from this side and blow the air out to the other side, to this side down here. You can hear it's running. So there, we're just gonna put it at the back like so of the laptop. So we'll put it at the back of the laptop like so. Make sure it's covering. The hole and then have your laptops just open up like so, and that will help um, uh, suck out the hot air within your laptops and prevent the laptop from overheating. It worked quite successfully with this uh, particular HP laptops, and uh, uh, there's uh, a lot of different fans that you can try. Um, some may work better than the other. Uh, if you buy a more expensive fan, I suppose it will work a lot better because um, the, the motor is, is better and it can last a lot longer. This motor tends to um, 
not last very long because it's quite uh, a cheap fan but it will it still do the job uh, if you get a better quality fan definitely uh, you do a much better job you can suck out the hot air I'm just going to switch back on because I just closed the lid and that uh, turned off the computer so when I have the fan on um, put on the external fan put on my laptop doesn't automatically shut down anymore it actually works quite well it can run for a long time but whenever the fans stop working the external fans stop working then the laptops get heats up and then it's um, get overheated and it stops working again so this is a quick solution uh, it's cheap you don't need to fix the internal fan you just need to plug it into the USB and it will work fine it will uh, allow you your laptop to stay cool and uh, yeah so you don't have to uh, bring it to the computer store to fix anything just uh, plug in an, an external fan and that will do the job I uh, hope this uh, helps helps you out if your computer is uh, freezing up keep lagging and freezing up and you don't want to spend too much money to get a fix thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel uh, for more videos thank you